Hi, everybody. I'm Wally Kennedy. We're live this morning from Philadelphia and Los Angeles. It can happen in the blink of an eye. You're up and then you're down. And who better to tell us about who's about to be the flavor of the month and who's on their way out than Star Magazine gossip columnist Janet Charlton. And for the first time on AM, Jennifer Young. She's got all the ingredients of the quintessential Hollywood party girl. She graduated from Beverly Hills High. Her father was Academy Award-winning actor Gay Young. Her mother's been a guest on this program, has been married six times, is the real estate broker to the stars. Yeah, Jennifer, well, I would ask you about the last one on the star rising category. You know, you're talking about Brad Pitt before. Of his same age and caliber and probably the same class of actor is a guy by the name of Ethan Hawke. Now, yeah. wh where is, where is, uh, I hear you he, laughing, why? <laughs> no, he is, I saw Reality Bites, and he just stole my heart. I think he is just unbelievable. And also, you know, he has a cut on that soundtrack. He's actually singing one of the songs in that movie. And I just think he's incredible. And I just wanted to also bring to your attention that I think another person that's going to be on their way up is Elle McPherson. She's just taken a, a house out in California for a year. Mm -hmm. And from what I understand, she can really act. And I think you're going to be seeing a lot more of Elle McPherson. In a, in a Beverly Hills party. <laughs> In, in those those exclusive kind of gatherings. Who's cooler to have at your party? Somebody from Friends or somebody from Beverly Hills 90210? Um, it just depends, I guess. I, I don't, on the town, I see a lot of them. I see Matt LeBlanc out all the time. I see Tori Spelling out all the time. Um, you know, mix them up and bring them on over. <laughs> <laughs> I, I read great. something this morning, Jennifer, perhaps you can comment about it. It was a big, big story in entertainment three or four years ago when NYPD, the first season, came on. David Caruso became a big, big star, even though he'd been working overnight. There was an item this morning in USA Today that was really kind of sad. He evidently surfaced last week at the Hollywood Walk of Fame, not to get a star. He was just there. And it turns out that the agency that represents him uh, doesn't even represent him anymore. The several movies that he left NYPD Blue to star in all bombed. And what's the, Jennifer, what's the moral of the story with David Caruso? I think he should have stuck, stuck with NYPD Blue. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. He just thought he was going to do really well on the big screen. I think he needs to go back to TV. A girl that likes to go out and have a good time. They're not what you think. Hard Copy goes undercover to bring you a portrait of a party girl. Now, grab your heels and cop an attitude. We go undercover with L.A.'s Party Girls. A party girl's just a girl that likes to go out and have a good time. Portraits of a party girl, next. A party girl's just a girl that likes to go out and have a good time. And Jennifer Young should know. She's the daughter of Oscar winner Gig Young. This is her exclusive tour. How sexy did you have to look? When Jennifer goes out on the town, it's a carefully planned campaign of seduction. Like this night, when she and her friends scrutinize her slinky wardrobe, where flesh and flash meet. Come on, swing. Some guys prefer blondes, right. and then they say blondes have more fun. And some guys prefer brunettes, so you kind of get, it's easy that way. Before Jennifer and her pal go nightclubbing, they warm up at a chic restaurant like Chaya Brasserie. <laughs> Pretty girl. Yeah, I like to go out, I like to have a good time, and I like to have fun. So if you want to call that a party girl, go ahead and call me one. <laughs> From the fast cars to the flashy outfits, it's a VIP world. The best weapon? Flash some flash. Every woman, you know, likes to have cleavage. <laughs> How important is it on the, on, the, on the club circuit, I mean, to show? Um, if you want to be noticed, I think it's very important. If you don't, then just... You know, you could might as well wear a sweater. <laughs> but to see and be seen is what it's all about for young Hollywood, where the latest Brat Packers seem to have gotten too much too soon and are tempted to live too fast. Elaine's daughter Jennifer has lived all her life with her mother's obsession, but it hasn't affected her the way you might expect. Jennifer Young is planning a singing career. And she knows that in Hollywood, looks count. Because, <laughs> you know, my dream is so important to me. And I once heard uh, Anastasia, An Anastasia, Anastasia, <laughs> say that... Uh, and you were so beautiful, and you didn't need to really do anything. Well, you're so beautiful, and you don't need to do anything. Well, you think so. I need to? You're, you're the one who helped get me the appointment? Well, <laughs> only, only because you wanted it so badly. Yeah, you're right, but for a singing career. Right. You know.